the Emperor's list of things to do after resurrection. The God Emperor of Mankind has been taking a bit of a breather lately, but don't think that he has stopped caring and looking after humanity. As a matter of fact, the Adeptus Custodes happen to have scribbled down this reassuring list of things that the Emperor intends to do once he's finished taking a little nap, scratched his non-existent nose and taken a bath. Rules for new entries. 1. Learn to spell. This is the Emperor's sacred to-do list, not the toilet paper roll of an illiterate 5 year old. 2. Keep crossovers to a minimum, especially dumb ones. Before you make it, ask yourself can it be funny without referencing non-Wahama stuff if the answer is yes, don't make the reference. 3. Read through the damn list before repeating the same damn thing over again, because having 5 entries, all asking for the same thing is stupid. Have you read it? Read it again. 4. Learn to be funny and not painfully annoying. Jokes are fine, bad jokes are not. Before you show us your wit, tell it to some friends and see if they laugh. If you don't have friends, tell it to your pet. If your pet is an iguana and therefore cannot talk, talk to the voices in your head and try to make them laugh. 5. Avoid excessive strike throughs and blaming, as it makes it hard for all of us to read. 6. Anyone who declares a state of anarchy or refers to this article as a thread, will be shot, dragged out behind the barnyard, beaten severely, run over with a banner blade, then shot again. 7. If you can't make jokes, then put some effort to make an insightful or interesting submission. Think about what the god emperor would actually do when he wakes up to the sight of a regressing civilization. 8. Do edit these rules. 9. For the eternal glory of Charkotham, I mean the emperor. The holy list in no particular order. Your faith in the Emperor shall assuredly be rewarded. The thing is that the Emperor of Mankind would be really pissed off upon returning his consciousness to his body and finding out what happened to his Imperium during his 10. 000 year long absence slumber upon the Golden Throne. In his absence, the idiots running the Imperium have become even more corrupt. The Imperial Truth has been forgotten by everyone. Some retards have got everyone worshipping me. Some maniacs are so fucked up they are just killing anyone useful, and the general state of affairs is through and through grimdark. This list describes the immediate improvements the Emperor of Mankind would install, steps towards a more noble bright galaxy. The list has also seen some additions made by the Adeptus Custodes and the Commissars of the Imperial Guard. Scratch my nose. Take a bath. Scratch my everything. Eat breakfast. Find my ballpoint pen. Punch Lager in the face. Then punch everyone else in the face. Roll around on the floor. Scream really loud. Get some tacos. Kill every single one of the marines malevolent. Because they deserve it. Look at this list and reorganize. Some items on the list are more important than others. Not enough DACA. Become seer and majority shareholder of Games Workshop. Execute and then replace its upper level employees and management. Recognize TG for its greatness. Clone Creed and make him commander of everything scratch that, resurrect Lord Solar Macharius, make him commander of everything, and make Creed his second in command of everything. Also, make the both of them into Primarchs for good measure. Find Dawn, and beat the living fuck out of him because his spiky iron halo popped my eye. Hand his so called Imperial Guards over to the Angry Marines. Then hand his entire military over the Angry Marines to use to decorate every chains ward in the galaxy with their guts. Build a new Death Star. I want a Death Star. Damn it. Scratch that. Get Titan converted into a new Starkiller base. Fuck. The Grey Knights would be good enough, but keep it away from the rest of the Inquisition. Actually, create something even bigger, just because I can. Important note stick a void shield on the thing. Very important note make sure it can't be blown up by a few lucky idiots doing a single thing somewhere important. Extremely important note make sure you plan to declare a crusade on Elder Craft World's not Exodites, waste of resources to make sure they don't stop you from building it. Take a shower, I smell worse than a plague marine at this point. Brush my teeth, because at this point, my halitosis could probably qualify for exterminators. Fix my fucked up face. Find Magnus, and spank him until his buttocks are in the infrared spectrum for ruining everything. Create Cat Gerals. Kill anyone who asks why, as they are too stupid to live. Destroy the gene manipulation records as to not enable anyone to make jackets. Never mind, turns out for lineage are already a thing. Saves me the trouble. Retry building the golden throne so that this time I can access the webway, but this time actually share it with other people and test it somewhere else off of holy terror. Add more bling to my palace, even more bling to my throne and go bling crazy on a new suit of armor. Drive around the M25 in a car so fast I dig a trench around London by friction. 
Table an elder player by turn 2 in an equal points game it's possible. I've just done it bitches. Recruit black guardsman bolter bitches. Eat something other than sick as babies. Seriously I need to eat more carbohydrates. And some protein. So I can get even more ripped. I know no one can see my muscles. But they need to be there. Don't forget your vitamins too. Dear. Eat a live carnifex without the aid of sources. Eat another live carnifex with the aid of sources. Turn yet another carnifex into sauce, while living, and use that as a source for the last live carnifex. Discover a way to cook tyrannids so they taste like buttered lobsters or fried bacon. That way, Imperial Guardsmen will not only be cheered up by the prospect of a good meal at the end of a battle, but they would also appreciate the irony of galaxy eaters suddenly becoming tasty grub. Hive ships, once dreaded, would become flying hors d'oeuvre splatters. Wash the carnifex meal down with a glass of soda and amasek. Further expand the Warhammer 40k storyline without the interference of Games Workshop. Teach the Imperial Guard Generals some actual tactics other than hey diddle diddle straight up the middle. Tell the Adeptus Mechanicus to stop keeping secrets and actually try to advance technology so we don't have to rely on whatever scraps from the dark age of technology we have left. Threaten to exterminate us Mars if they don't. Replace the Imperial Guardsman Lasgans with something that can actually do shit. Probably some pulse rifles or gorse flares. Get a Militarum Codex for all the Segmenta and make Militarum Solar entirely from Adeptus Custodes in Necrodermis. Make up with Matthew Ward as he isn't that bad. G-Dubs still made shit in his absence. Kick that Star Wars Emperor's ass. Proceed to reverse engineer their lasers and proceed to make Lasgans better. Hang out with Darth Vader. Gather every Guardsman, Astartes, Inquisition Operative, Sororita, Commissar, Hell, everyone in the Imperium of Man, give them weapons. Have them surround the Eye of Terror and then let the greatest of all holy shit storms ensue. Optional proceed to create black hole producing weaponry and launch a ton of the Eye of Terror. On that note, find a way to bring Calder Drago from the warp. I need him because he gets shit done. Fuck Calder Drago, he's insane yet funny. Find someone just as awesome as me to get some shit done. Doom good eye. Out Angry Angron. Out Six Full Grim. Out Fortify Percherabo. Out Wid Magnus. Out Speed Khan. Out Preach Logger. Out Drink Russ. Out Tender and Smorterian and out Forge Vulcan. Personally execute Full Grim. Percherabo. Angron and the rest of them traitor primarchs. After the Inquisition has given them a proper torturing. Except Fulgrim. No torture for him will be torture enough. Beat Corn in an arm wrestling match. Thus avenging my prior defeat at his hands, then rip his arm off and beat him to death with it. Show Slanesh my dick and watch his hers its sweet tears of envy. If Slanesh doesn't cry, just dick slap the bitch into corn's arms and eat popcorn while hilarity ensues. Hug Papa Nurgle and remain pure. Get Tisha out of Nurgle's clutches, then watch as every elder witch freaks out, incidentally causing the eye of terror to blink. Just as planned. Seduce Isha, just to prove that I can, and watch as Nurgle gets pissed off. Fuck Isha so hard that every elder is gonna feel their asses sore. Also make sure to live a stream it. Give Nurgle a bath, with holy water made by distilling the blood of 1 trillion saints. Make Nurgle feel gut-wrenching sadness so bad his cultists won't be so unnaturally happy. Run before plagues eat Nurgle alive for not being diseased enough, spontaneously combusting with the power of 10 of my legendary power swords. Devise a scheme so elaborate and complex that I'll be the one to say just as planted siege. Make sure it better than what Creed could come up with. Then do the same thing to Commander Puretide. And then do the same to Imatek the Storm Lord. And then do the same to Eldred. Then get Creed, Imatek, Puretide, Eldred, Eteos Rorkirs, the Swarm Lord and Karas in state as the new eggheads. Out Dick Eldred. Then screw both of his daughters in front of him. Again. At the same time. Go back in time and get Eldred to have more daughters, so that I can have an orgy in front of him. While you're at it, create a time travel paradox nuke to destroy the universe for leverage over chaos and everyone else. Just as planned. Apologize to Tall Deer by officiating at her wedding with Lee Ivy and make that canon. Go back in time multiversal travel required to and tell the dumb fuck at Games Workshop Matthew Ward who fucked up the 5th edition of Codex starts that he's doing it wrong. The dude to made the Imperial Guard better that he's doing it right. Tomb Kings and Tyranids disagree. Then go to the guy who decided to give the guard flashlights and take him to the Inquisition to be properly tortured. Make a Total War version of Warhammer done. Make a Total War version of Warhammer 40k. Permit Space Marines and Sisters of Battle to date. Well, 
the Astartes call themselves my sons, and the sororities say they're my daughters. Maybe this plan is a wee bit awkward? But I want grandkids, and the last time I was a dad, my son Horace went and ruined Christmas for everybody. Be a better father to the rest of my sons, as not to spark another shitstorm that will inevitably cripple me for another few millennia. Go on a deer hunting trip with some Vindicare and bag more kills than him using my kickers flay with my mind powers. Overshadow a Niversar assassin during his dynamic entry. Deceive a Calidus assassin with disguises and trick her into having a romantic relationship with me. Outbrood a Kilexus assassin and still remain awesome. Deceive the Setan false Gabon the deceiver by tricking him into giving over control of the Necrons to me. Find the Setan called the Outsider and rehabilitate him. If not possible, kick him into a black hole. Find out what if anything is chasing the Tyranids and see if they're friendly. If not launch the prototype Prometheum planetary bombardment torpedo. Once again out Dick Eldred in the game of his choice, forcing him to rage quit. Beat a Lord of Change Greater Demon in a game of chess with only 5 moves. Then beat it in 4. Make a better emergency life support system as a safeguard if things for some reason go south. By that I mean make some kind of Emperor Dreadnought or some shit like that so I can still do my job instead of all this being a decaying corpse on some tricked out toilet worshipped by the entire population. Did I mention how much this sucks? I heard that an old fart by the name of Karamazov has a Dreadnought as a chair. Personally get that Dreadnought backup plan started better idea. Make myself a fucking Imperator Titan as my Dreadnought backup plan. Actually, fuck that. Build a Dreadnought that goes in an Imperator Titan. Outright skullfuck slanish for making something so good be so wrong and heretical. Eliminate masturbation across the Imperium and in its place have sanctioned sex workers as part of the socialized medical program No, I think I had it right before so nobody will be stuck comforting themselves alone ever again. Go out the Eldred one last time. Then put all the Elder he saved when he got the Orcs to invade Armageddon in a life threatening situation. Let Eldred try and save them. Laugh as he fails. Save them so I get to be the bigger man. Make a note of where they all are so next time Eldred pisses me off I can kill them without wasting too much time. Send search parties throughout the empire to find that awesome excuse for a space viking, Lemon Russ, and if he's found alive, hand his ass to him like I did before I got stuck on this throne. Prove the existence of the Alpha Legion. Get those two exiled legions back again, they've blasted enough Tyranids in other galaxies by now. Give Alpharius and Omegan a hug for staying secretly loyal and fighting chaos from within for 10,000 years, then ground them for a decade for all the damage they did in the process. Invent a more reliable warp drive in order to expand the Imperium to a into galactic empire. Create a special rule just for myself so that instead of just one unit as a scout, I field an entire regiment's worth of troops as scouts. Beat a commissar at a western style shootout. Recognize the Legion of the Damned for their awesomeness and badassery. Challenge Sly Marbo to a duel to decide who is the greatest being in the entire universe. Beat a TAU broadside battlesuit in ranged combat using only an angry glare. Hunt down my legendary power sword. Again. Never mind apparently Rob out found it. Ask him if he can give it back. Come up with a name for my legendary power sword more original than the burning blade. Use the warp to go back in time. Find myself and beat myself in a duel. So I can have two legendary power swords. Grow a goddamn beard. How can I be considered manly without a beard? Also, how the fuck none grew in 10 fucking thousand years? Find the canon Nazi using this list as his own personal toilet paper to wipe his shit on and mail him to Kamorag. Throw a wag. Invite the orcs to said wag. Aim said wag. At the Necrons Tyranids. Bring a camera. Question mark? Profit. Find Lion Elginson and get him back on the front line owning shit. Resurrect Rogaldorn Rogaldorn's hand, and stitch it back on. Disable Rob out Gilliman's life support. Never mind, someone got him off his lazy blue butt. Find out who resurrected him and keep them on retainer in case things go ploin shaped again. Create a first founding 2.0 to make the angry marines, manly marines and those other guys canon. Come up with more shit for the emperor's list of things to do after resurrection 2.0 if things do go south for some reason and the emperor dread titan ain't ready yet. Turn the Armageddon conflicts into a 24 stroke 7 reality TV channel, just like in that fantastic movie The Truman Show. Invent a deodorant that works on Typhus. Promote Cypher to Warmaster, he's clearly more competent than any other human that got to that rank. He seems more reliable than even Lion Elginson. Fuck. Trip out and drink the whole of Kamorag under the table, and then kick punt their stoned asses into hell. 
proceed to turn the remnants of Kamorag into a family-friendly theme water park called Impraland. Featured attractions Balam the Xenos, Hot Heretic and Dismember the Demon. Somehow regain my love and compassion. Can't let the Imperium into non-grimdarkness without that, you know. Figure out how to get my awesome source body back since I lost all my limbs to decomposition. Make the Ultramarines stop boasting how awesome they are while in fact they fuck up almost every vital engagement. Thus, first I must make them really awesome, and then I won't need to tell about it to anyone since it will be a fact in itself. Somehow find a way to come back without sparking off galaxy-wide hysteria. Seriously, who would have thought being considered a Gabon would suck so hard? Redesign the power armor pauldrons. Can't see shit with these things on. I mean fuck. Also, I can't fucking scratch my neck without smashing my head. While I'm at it, find out why the fucking hell I thought that was a good idea to have those things so big in the first place. Design a helmet awesome enough for me. Let's see wannabe Hoyuses try to mortally wound me when all of me is covered in armor. Invent a power staircase. Resurrect Malkada the hero and give him a shiny medal for his troubles. On second thought, better make it two shiny medals. We're talking really shiny. Here, it's like, damn son. So shiny. Actually give him three shiny medals. Heresy. Give him four shiny medals. Actually, a suit of Auramite power armor with the awards engraved in the chest. Add a architect refractor in there too. Congratulate Failbadden for doing more damage to the forces of chaos than my armies could have done in the same amount of time by being an incompetent fuck. Then dick slap him back into the warp. Use time machine to bring Archeon into the 41st millennia and watch him beat Abaddon with with his own arms and take his place so I may have a worthy opponent. Boot Kato Sicarius into the Eye of Terror and get Captain Titus to lead the second company. Surf a flying leviathan. Surf an emperor class titan. Surf the energy beam from an overcharges volcano cannon. That orbital spire is going down. Get Forge World to make a fluff accurate miniature of me. Make a legendary thunder shield for myself. Make my armor out of necrodermis. I'll be invincible then. Find a way to miniaturize a void shield into that. Failing that, an iron shield. Make Commissar Yerrick into a living son. I'm tired of corn bragging about how cool Angrath is and how I have nothing to match him. So I want my own version. Resurrect Syrphus Kane and form the forward retreat legion for him to command. Collect each and every one of the bajillion pieces of Kane. Put them together. And as he resurrects, punch him so hard that he'll fall apart into two bajillion pieces. Create a super sleeping pill for the void dragon so he'll never wake up. In case it won't work, I will pummel him back to sleep personally. It worked before, thus I suppose it wouldn't be too much harder a second time, but I have a lot of better things to attend to so the sleeping pill is worth a try. Finally win a game of Paradox Poker. Yes it's fun to get together with Tsinj, the Deceiver, and Segarach every Saturday night for these games of dickery. But it's about time that someone won one of these games and it might as well be me. Maybe I can bring Creed along to help. Invent a translator for the hive mind so it doesn't sound like a thousand mental patients gargling a million nails in motor oil and weird syntax and can become a regular player. Privatize said translator and form a secret alliance with the hive mind, and then talk shit about the others behind their backs after making sure the translator works two ways. Organize my birth century party. It's gonna be an awesome party that'll last 10,000 days. Out prank and out funny segarach. Probably the most difficult thing to do on my list. Set up arrangements for my return where I launch myself out of a Vindicator and hit a demon prince, causing him to explode. Figure out how to tell my man bitches to add pimp wheels to my golden throne then maybe a magma cannon or something badass. Rear falster the golden throne. Develop better plans to stop global warming and acid rain on her viewer old planets. Beat a baton with his own arms. Recharge my isle aspects. Update it to, oh me, the update time. Beat Mad Ward and CS go to over the head with their crappy works. Tell the Black Templars to chill the fuck out. On second thought gather them into the 10,000 strong unstoppable faucets in the codex it must be so and destroy the Eye of Terror. Release Bjorn and find the Space Wolves a kennel. Get the Space Wolves a damn flea collar. Win a blinking contest with the Eye of Terror. Fetch Badassius his coat. Look up affordable retirement plans. I am so sick of babysitting some of these hopeless morons. Challenge Doomrider into a space coke snorting contest. Then laugh at him as he dies from overdosing on the stuff. Convince Doombreed to allow a model of himself to be made. Get a haircut. Ensure my hair is even more fabulous. Have a trip over to the dentist. Exterminatus Equestria. And their sun and moon as well. Do those first actually. Be Chuck Norris with his own legs. 
Start an intergalactic fast food chain. MPs Impanadas. Invent a time machine. Guarantee that Magnus won't fuck up my invention again. Rip his eye out and beat him to death with it. Use the time machine to drink lemon rus under the table. Using the time machine so I can eat more than lemon rus as well. Hatch an extremely complicated time machine plot. Go back in time and give yourself a time machine and all future information. Do something cool? Figure out how to twist reality better? Uh, running out of ideas. Annihilate Horus? Do something about your fall. What fall? No matter what happens, the world will. Wait is it will always or is? Question mark? Question mark? Profit? Assign a Primarch to the Angry Marines. Assign Zoloft Regiment to newly anointed Primarch of the Angry Marines. Find my driver's license and look up own name. Clean house with the administratum. How can we get shit done when we don't know how much we have to work with? Dig out my office from all the paperwork Pete Moss that has accumulated over the years decades centuries fucking millennia. Not looking forward to this one. Get my old battleship for a shortcut. Make galaxy wide web and ban Lord Commissar from everything. Spy on everyone with no mercy. Chaos will corrupt through the web or some stupid explanation via chaos magic. Invent a social network purely for space marines accessible from any data slate called for semarine.com. Invent a website called 40,000 chanorg so that humanity will finally be rid of the iral trolls that have taken control over the hive cities, instead of the internet. Out angry a angry marine. Out manly a manly marine. Out pretty a pretty marine. Utterly destroy all for faggotry. Space wolves and cat generals not included. Beat myself in arm wrestling with only one arm. Beat Commissar Fuckloy in a Chains War duel. Then every angry marine. Tell the Blood Ravens to stop dicking around in the Aurelia subsector and get to work on that Eye of Terror thing. Cure Space Aids by wiping out those filthy Dark Elder. Pimp the Golden Throne so that I may score even more bitches. Make a show called The Fresh Emperor of Sacred Terror. Get new toilet paper. This 40,001 year mega pack has almost run out. Turn off my nightlight. Seems that everyone was using it for something. Well. No big deal I guess. Actually, create something better, which is a radius bigger than 50,000 light years. Doesn't cause the deaths of 1,000 sickers every day find a better use for them but most importantly doesn't need me to control it. I mean come on, my time is too important to just act as a giant psychic signpost. Order all thrones, chairs and benches destroyed, or out of my sight at least, on pain of exterminatus cheesius, which is like getting creamed, but harder. Build a gold fortress at the center of Terra to enslave troglodytes. Become human parasite. Go back in time. Beat entire GW executive board over the head with a power bat and then give the Warhammer 40,000 license to someone willing to do a good job of it. Scratch that. Go back in time. Resurrect THQ and tell them to make 5 more Space Marine games. Punch Mork in the balls, with Gork's severed fist. Demote Creed and his friends who keep fucking with my list. Beat Swarm Lord and Minfuck Hive Mind. Pray night and day that Frank Herbert's family doesn't sue the shit out of me for blatantly ripping him off. Get Andy Chambers back. Kick every heretic who claimed the Space Marine game was a ripoff of Gears of War Starcraft and the balls with power feet. Then send the angry marines in. Beat Matt Ward to death with CS Goto. Beat CS Goto to death with Matt Ward's corpse. Give the Nightbringer nightmares about me. Resurrect Sanguinius. Tell him how much I missed him. Resurrect Ferris Manus. Find Lemon Russ, Corvus Corax, Jagate Khan and Vulcan then get their asses back to Battlefield. Tell the Dark Angels I forgive them so they stop being emo and ambiguously heretical, and they can get back to kicking the asses of my enemies. Sit down and have a cup of tea. Because it's just been that fucking long. Find a way to recreate Horus's soul and then destroy it again. Then do it again. Put a new password on my computer to stop all these heretics from accessing my damn list. Buy a really big gun to gather a load of orcs and shit in the middle of nowhere. Then virus bomb said area. Take a dump on the golden throne. Congratulate Vant Mathur fucking stubs. Go out on a shopping day to buy a new outfit, because this golden armor set is just so 10 millennia ago. Order the inquisition to torture the fuck out of Ye's board of directors. Use proceeds to pay for power armor for every frontline soldier in the Imperial Guard. Commissars get Terminator armor. Modify the Imperial Palace to be able to transform into Gabon Emperor class Super Titan. Play Matt Ward in a game of Warhammer 40k. Let him build the ultimate broken Ultramarines Grey Knights army. Destroy him in the first round with the Sisters of Battle army. Fuck that, an Imperial Guard army. 
collect tears of Butthurt and despair from him losing. Go back in time and reduce the prices at Games Workshop. Unfuck the galaxy again. Then proceed to make sure it won't be fucked again. Without annihilating all sentient beings and therefore killing chaos and destroying the universe without causing it to crunch. Adopt cultist Chan. Hire a dialect coach and orthodontist for her. Find a terrorist and make it my personal pet. Commend Captain Titus for not succumbing to ultramarine stereotypes. Conclude the ceremony by striking brother Leandros the ungrateful fucking smurf and the testicles with a thunder hammer. Get some preparation H from the apothecaries. Revise imperial naval doctrine to emphasize that space is not a fucking ocean. Write a best-selling autobiography. Buy a shop vac and drain Korn's lake of blood. Dump hydrofluoric acid on his skull pile until it is a calcium slurry. Laugh scornfully at Korn's unbelievable rage as the work of centuries goes to waste in a few hours. Tell everyone to cheer up. The universe is depressing enough. I don't need an entire empire worth of wangst. Create a chastity belt out of necrodermis and put it on Slanesh. Then create a matching Balgag and shackles in case the fucker might get creative. This won't get kinkier, won't it? Introduce football to orcs and create elaborate stadiums, as to distract them from killing us. Weaponize a Vuvuzla and beat a noise marine with it. Get new ballpoint pens because this damn list is draining the ink. Create a new space marine chapter dedicated to making pens with holiness. Consider ways to liven up sports with the introduction of power armor fists. Disband the Ultramarines chapter and show Matt Ward what has been done as part of the torture. If not as planned occurs and Matt Ward ignores you rob him into the most applicable. Revive the squats blam squids a heresy. Piss on Horus Maggoty, heretical corpse. Resurrect Horus again and beat him to an inch away from death. Then put him in life support stasis for 10. 000 years and make sure he feels every second of it let's see how he likes being in agony for countless millennia. Teach the Adeptus Mechanicus there is no such thing as machine spirits, and tell them they can start using AI and computers more. See notes regarding Imperial Navy for immediately apparent uses. Then shit an Imperial Palace worth of bricks as the Void Dragon takes over everything in the Age of Strife happens all over again. Congratulate the Legion of the Damned. Give the remaining Lamenters a hug. They deserve it. Determine if sexual virility has remained intact. If not, demand the necessary supplements under pain of death. Dominate a sister of battle in bed. Find a way to build blackstone fortresses. Use as part of plan to shoot the eye of terror out of existence. Deal with all the spam on 1d4 chan. Bring back Warhammer Wednesday. Make a 40k version of Blood Bowl. Make Blood Bowl the Imperium's official sport. Invite the Elder, Chaos and the Orc forces to participate in Blood Bowl games. Proceed to rig every game. Just as planned. Kill Gorgots, if he doesn't run away from the fight, like he did on Lawn, Cronus and Karova. Create for myself a massive golden space caddy to roll around the Imperium and fuck bitches in. Train the commissars to stop executing their own men and start executing furries that are useless instead. Officially recognize the reasonable marines as the knight's inductor. I need a space marine chapter that doesn't go trigger happy when they encounter heresy and xenos. Take a vacation to Penn Island. Get at least one space marine commander, preferably a grey knight, in some future Warhammer game to be voiced by James Earl Jones. Get a high ranking character in said game to be voiced by Morgan Freeman. Eat a pie with a live carnifex inside with the aid of sources. Look disapprovingly at the Ekelshiaki then bitch slap the priests. Reintroduce the imperial truth, but this time, inform my citizens and soldiers of the dangers of chaos and how to prevent it from infecting them. Overhaul the Imperial Guard stance on martial justice. If I happen to catch a commissar shooting a recruit out of a meaningless quibble, I will beat him with my bare fists and he will have to be permanently accompanied by a servo skull equipped with a colostomy bag. Commissar Reasonable agrees. Research ways to prepare orcs as a palatable substitute for corpse starch rations, much like the ancient Terran food product corn, would also increase morale among common soldiers as they would treat a wide like a grox dinner with amasic on legs. Find way to make bolt mounted power field generators feasible? Perhaps I should look at the angry marines adamantine sack of power doorknobs. Place an imperial edict forbidding the use of baroque and gothic architecture. Who knows how many resources were spent gilding those fucking stupid space cathedrals. Use a hive city as a toothpick. Make a new edition of epic armageddon. Try to domesticate some tyrannids so that we can ride them like war horses or some shit. I don't think it will work then again the orcs managed to do it but I just want to see if we can manage it. 
Besides even if it doesn't work it will probably be a fun experience assuming nobody gets eaten. Crush Dumrada into a fine powder and snort him. Party with Pedro Cantor and promote him to Imperial Fist Primarch. Invent a way to make female marines, and give them all to the Crimson Fists. Those poor bastards need it. Introduce the angry marines to megaphones. Establish the Adeptus Astartes legions once again and rewrite the Codex Astartes to emphasize tactical and strategic flexibility. Arrange a checks and balances system similar to the Iron Hands for the purposes of chapter administration. Those who protest this action will be redirected to the complaints department, which happens to be located on my power fist. Design and make new shit Mechanicus won't can't do it, fucking toaster fuckers. Give a honey badger power armor and use it as a weapon. Name said Honey Badger Chapter Master of the Angry Marines. They're gonna love it. Build a tank to crush a motherfucking banner blade. Give it to Yerik as a present. Invent crack grenade tennis with thunder hammers for rackets. Invent crack grenade baseball with thunder hammers for bats. Invent crack grenade cricket with thunder hammers for bats. Invent crack grenade golf with thunder hammers for clubs. Beat the squig in a banner blade race. Declare tank motorsports as an official sport. Amass a fleet of a million ships and finish kicking the shit out of everything else in the galaxy. Bring back the enslavers. Then enslave them. Make a banner blade the size of a Emperor Titan. Make a Titan the size of a Emperor class battleship. Make a Emperor class battleship the size of a world engine. Help the Necrons to build a world engine the size of the Eye of Terror. Then destroy it. Because I can. Steal Necron starships. Traveling the galaxy without warp drives? Fuck yeah, I want that. Learn how to make Tyranid Calamari. Learn how to make Tyranid Tikka Masala. Learn how to make Tyranid Sushi. Play hide and seek with Slime Marbo and with the Tanith first and only guys. It'll be interesting to see why they can't find the deity of mankind who wears golden power armor and is over 3 meters tall. Declare Catachin exploding turtles dubbed mine turtles by the local populace an endangered species. Seriously, these things explode all over the fucking place. Find a way to get a truce with the Elder and or TAU Empire, then throw a galaxy and webway wide party with said allies. Outlaw the Appalachians MP, Emperor, Biggie and so on. Not addressing me with my real name is heresy. Dissolve the Ekelshiaki. I hate those creepy fucks. Ask Officio Assassinorum about drugs they're using on the Versus, then start selling it in Kamorag. If you can't defeat them, make money on them. I always say that. After my Imperial dealers completely take over the city, have them kick Dark Elderers back to hell where they belong. Then fill this place with so much sex, drugs and gambling that it will put Las Vegas Dicky Drubby to shame. And there will be demonettes serving drinks, or you can call me Emperor. Open a zoo with rhinos in metal cages. Any visitors will be executed as heretics. Encourage creative thinking, like there is better way to use guardsmen than suicidal wave or not everyone is heretic and need to be destroyed among my forces. Pay orcs to make me another life sustaining device. As long they believe it works, it works, because it's really piss me off that most powerful psychic in the whole space can't keep himself in shape. Hire a squad of orcs, then order them to loot vehicles of other races. Soon the looted monoliths and looted mantas will conquer the world. Pay a visit to TAU. Then show them the meaning of old tear and saying better dead than red. Or blue, in that case. Blue faced reds are enough blasphemy in my galaxy. Promptly remember that the Soviet Union under Stalin was still more benevolent and just than the Imperium in my millennia long bathroom break. Get off the damn throne and find something suitable to wipe my own ass, ohh look a grey knight. Lure every furfag to an unused planet using Faptor and Schlichtor as bait, then utilize any form of exterminators, thus solving the galaxy-wide furfag problem. Not those that make themselves useful. They'd fuck the Folinids anyways. Send a whole fucking legion of Speechmarines to Mars and get them to finally clear out all the rogue robots from thousands of years ago living in the catacombs below Mars. Realize my mistakes as a father and further realize that my sons have actual emotions and stabbing them in the back humiliating them letting those with obvious problems led legions of dedicated. Killers might not have been the best idea so I know what to do when I make Primark Project. Part 2. Launch a cross-dimensional crusade to destroy all chakots. Hire the Atroxy to blow up a planet, but only give them 19 minutes to do so. Steal all of Trazin's artifacts leaving behind a note with kindest regards. Engage Hive Mind in Physic Duel. Use Ficker Destroying Finishing Move. Range Galaxy. Fix the rest of the Sickers in the galaxy. One Howling was bad enough. Relearn how to spell Sicker and Psychic. I invented those words. Damn it. 
Beat up corn while dressed as Slanesh. Bleach memory of having dressed as Slanesh from brain. Rebuild the avatar of Kane from the two bajillion pieces. Then lock him and Slanesh in a cage. Shatter whoever lives into four bajillion pieces. And hide the four bajillion pieces with greed. Challenge a dreadnought to a fist fight. Stand on the bow of a battle barge and shout fly me closer. I want to hit them with my sword destination eye of terror. Targets chaos gods. Throw space wolves and ultramarine bone. Quality family time. Play laser tag with flashlights. Bring back Conrad Kurz. Fix his brain. And then get him to explain what he was rambling on about just before he died. Clone Judge Dread and use said clones to replace the Adeptus Arbites. Create a training system for the Imperial Guard so my citizens are more effective than glorified meat shields. Create a chapter of Space Marines made up of only pariahs just to troll Siege. Give some nice relics to the Celestial Lands to help them rebuild. Inform Inquisitors that a loyal Space Marines chapter complaining about an exterminatus after the chapter has taken out the actual heretics is no reason to get all pissy. Send the Inquisitors that got all upset about that into a Orc Wag. To look for Orc Snipers. Replace the Imperial Guard's vehicles after chassis that weren't considered obsolete by World War II in exchange for stuff that's more functional. Also find out why the hell I thought that was a smart idea in the first place. Improve ship design so that time and resources aren't wasted putting details on making the sides of the ship look like cathedrals and including oversized figureheads that serve no practical use. Kill Chuck Norris and disprove all the facts about him, they have no place in the Imperial Truth. He is too manly to simply be worshipped as a mere god. He is Chuck Norris. Make the Space Wolves to be accompanied by Sabbat and Amon Amarth as they play 24 stroke 7. Make an ironically underpowered Codex Matt Ward. Rarite the Sisters of Battle Codex. My bitches need some love. And some gigantism fun with their Estarts brothers. Build a fucking anti-grav hammerhead banner blade combo. Tell Dawn and Perturabo to kiss and make up. Get my wallet back from the blood magpies. Steal Ariman's library card. Bring Karen back, and lock him in a metal box as a prison. Go to Mars. Punch the Void Dragon back to Terra. Teleport to Terra and punch it back to Mars. Afterwards go ask the Mechanicus where's their machine Gabon. Make a deal with the hive mind to eat everything except the Imperium. Breed giant Carnifex to eat the Eye of Terra. Give the Gin Stealer some Geens. Preferably from a Burkrumby and Fitch. Get my hands on some ethereal pheromones, then use them to get the TAU to join the Imperium, just as planned. Then sterilize those weebs as a taste of their own medicine. Led a live ray enactment of D-Day using guardsmen and cultists. Glue my model of Abaddon's arms on, rip the real Abaddon's arms off and proceed to beat him to death with them. Resurrect Horus for round 2 and fuck him up, more than last time. Aura. Tell Games Workshop that fucking axes are done wieldy. Seriously. How are fucking augmented superhumans and fucking powered armor in any way slowed by a slightly heavy fucking stick? I mean all the weight of an axe is focused in a pretty hard to control spot by a kinesthetic standpoint unless you want to break your wrist trying to stop a massive weight moving super fast with a relatively small handle. And with them being space marines, their axes are fuckhoog but sure, axes are somehow simpler to wield even though fantasy and sci-fi axes are some of the most bullshit things to be devised. This is why they use swords. Also axes are pretty ineffective against armor compared to hammers. Plus ineffective towards spooshies compared to swords. You only use them as a middle ground. But sure, act like you know all about weapons and nerdridge. Okay. Ask the person about GW's butthole tastes. Destroy the metaphorical shark so that no franchise can ever jump it again. Throw Michael Grade into a woodchipper. Then have the wood chipper dismantled and melted into slag for getting Michael Grade's filth that is, any piece of him on it. Learn the doctor's real name. Catch em all. Become the king of games. Including fatal. Rip off a stompers super scorker and use it to make tyrannid toast. Because I'm just so damn hungry after counting the dead bodies. Steal skulls from corned throne and torn dangrath with them as I teleport back to terror. Go to sleep. What? I'm fucking sleepy and I have not had a descent sleep in ages. Drop that whole Latin high gothic thingy as an official language. Seriously WTF was I thinking when naming Adeptus Mechanicus, Astartes and Astra Militarum. Make my own animation studio to make adaptations of anime based on manga that didn't get finished. Use profits as part of my ongoing plan to become majority shareholder of Google. Put an end to YouTube's copyright policy, then find those ashats that put came up with it and make them eat their own bones. Watch TV. Fuck some shit up. Fuck some sluts up. Fuck some car TG girls up. 
Firebomb MLP seriously, I don't fucking care about MLP but that board is pure nope. Get some nibs and let them rip those fucking petter douchebags to fucking mincemeat. Fuck some more sluts up. Oh yeah. Get some Taco Bell. Close McDonald's. Open Bembus. Watch the last Airbender anime series not the fucking M. Night Shyamalan piece of shit. Burn the legend of horror. Kill M. Night Shyamalan and piss on his corpse. Make melter explosives that can be fired from missile launchers. I'm sick of having to always get in the enemy's face to use metal weapons. Get the internet to shut up about Call of Duty this does include any other ones as well. I'm know everyone else with a life is sick of hearing about it. Out tank Astra with a rhino, because why not? Give orcs something that can make a loud noise and can finally do shit. Release the kraken and after it has finished destroying the enemies of mankind, proceed to turn it into calamari. Eat pie. I like pie. Check progress on Grey Knight attempts to crossbreed Saiyans and Kryptonians for any females. Also progress on capturing persuading Samus Aran to become a new Primark for female space marines. Twice the woman power. Marry said females. That will scare off that scary empress bitch. Sort out the contradictions in this list. Things a fucking mess. Commit fraud. Disband the Church of Scientology and send all the criminals in it to Guantanamo for crimes against humanity. Defeat the Reapers. Hi this is Commander Shepard, and GW is my favorite store on the Citadel. Get called a Drago into an intervention because he is hooked on fucking warp dust. Light my scented candle collection for proper relaxation. Collect all the Crux Terminus badges so I can put my golden armor back together. Come up with the most absurd, annoying, head-wrenching question I possibly can. Ask it repeatedly to that Zathras tool and laugh as his brain explodes. Create a giant can of bug spray and use it on all of the Tyranids. Make Captain Titus Papa Smurf. We need someone who can make decisions without reading the book Robo Jellyman wrote 10,000 years ago. Steal the Blood Ravens. Everyone's mother. Track down the Time Lord known as the Doctor. Shake his hand. Break his hand. Kick his ass. Steal the TARDIS and use it for the betterment of the Imperium. Do some stretching because 10,000 years will give you such a crick in the neck. Resurrect Robin Williams for some decent propaganda. Drop kick a hive tyrant into the sun. Order a pizza, because it's been fucking years since I had takeaway food. Maybe order enough for my custodes. They need some free time too. Find a Xenos controlled planet, and bomb the fuck out of the filthy Xenos scum. Note to self orcs are probably easiest. Astrally visit other space opera universes to see how they do things, then make fun of them. Starting with space balls. Find some more things to do. Find a living astral knight. Find a cloning device for said astral knight. Create a Primark for Astral Knight 2.0. Forgive the people of Krieg of their 1000 year old rebellion and tell them to stop being meat shields. Well, bigger meat shields than the guard usually are. They can even feel pride for being decent human beings again. Make deep strike safer so we don't have to fucking kill all the terminators. Shoot whoever started the whole metal boxes thing. I mean, Jesus, rhinos are elaborate machinery. Tell the orcs they are drunk and should go home. After collecting all the Crux Terminators pieces, sell them on eBay and give all the money to THQ so they can finally fucking make Dark Millennium online. Make warp dust into a smokable drug. Tell the angry marines to fuck themselves and thus piss them off even more. Make the Imperial Guard useful. Kill whoever wrote the last entry for extreme heresy. Give Commissar Yerik better stats. Slap each and every blood angel forever siding with or allowing their battle brothers to side with Necrons. At any point. Do a word bearers with said blood angels, in front of Gilliman's preserved body. Teach all my children's legions that I made each of them different for a reason. Inform ultramarines to think of the next step if things don't go as planned but tell them it's nothing personal. Do CPR to Gilliman. Already done. Give each guardsman a pair of brass balls to intimidate their enemy's allies with. Trazin was here. Kill the idiot that didn't actually contribute and instead just signed his name. Eldred was here too. Creed. Find and anally rape a demon at Slanesh. Take pictures of Sklictor and give them to Faptor and vice versa. Put a giant fleshlight into a Emperor class titan just to have another one fuck it fuck it himself. Have an ultramarine get lost in it. Make everyone look at demon at titties for one hour a week. Install a slut dispenser into the golden throne. Have ultramarines drink alcohol so they are not so fucking boring. They might not be able to get drunk off of it, but that's what the elephant tranquilizer is for. Find out where my bitches of silence went. How the fuck did Gilliman get them to come out of hiding? 
Girls love smurfs. Find the sanguiner and beat him in a duel. Following my inevitable victory against the sanguiner, find out who the fuck he is and bitch slap him. If he is sanguineous he deserved it for not announcing himself for who he is and not fixing my crumbling MP, equals heresy. If he is not sanguineous he gets another bitch slap for impersonating my second favorite son. Set the record straight regarding Elenius Pius. Get Django Fett the lead stormtroopers. Clone him. Use his gene seed to create an army of bounty marines. Get them to assassinate all the assassins. Get them to assassinate the Assassino Ministorum. Make them the new Assassino Ministorum. Do not let him have a son. I don't want to deal with the Sarlacc pit every few years. Organize the marriage of Miranda Nero and Captain Titus. If they wanted the plot of Space Marine, those two would have ended up getting married. On that note, I should allow Space Marines time to copulate with strong females. Would allow for a greater number of compatible gene seed initiates. Canonize Robin Willems 1 as a motherfucking Imperialson. Why? Because I like to laugh and he makes me feel good. That's why. Resurrect Lord Solomacherius as he seemed like a pretty competent general as well as a tactical genius. And heal his war wounds so he can be fully badass. Play cards against humanity. Resurrect those Dumbass Inquisitors who started a war with the Space Wolves and then execute them as example for how fucking stupid they were. By any means necessary get it into the Inquisition's thick skulls that they were wrong for us starting a war with the Space Wolves and apologize for being heartless dumb shits. Get some proper aircraft. We fucking need em. Change the battle doctrine of the Imperial Guard to rely more on air superiority and less on throwing waves of men and tanks the enemy. Cure Indlik bore a rail of his speech impediment and death. Find Vulcan. Give him a hug and the rest of his chapter 2. Troll Traz in the infinite and steal his everything. Build an army of sexy robot wafers that don't need to carry weapons because they everything the need built into them. If some animes and JRPGs can do it then I can do it better. Also make them all lesbians. Figure out which branch of the Imperium to put the above army into. Convince all orcs that I'm the most powerful being in the universe and that I can't be killed. Include an online tutorial on Games Workshop's website for each game it sells. If it's good enough for privateer press and fantasy flight games it's good enough for us. Do away with the practice of separating Terminator squads between ranged and assault. The Dark Angels made the idea work and Terminators don't carry anything that warrants staying at long range as it is. Go back to before the Age of Strife and Steel reclaim all the, the lost STCS. And whole Forge Worlds if necessary. Mass produce skimmer fill blades. Destroy all overused memes. Help the Krons reach their apotheosis thing. And then have the angry marines cock knob them so they don't fuck with my Imperium. Get those two sisters of battle to confess to each other already. Seriously. I'm tired of them acting awkward and shy around each other when they are clearly in love. Install a speech device on the golden throne. Just in case I need to fix the Imperium's fuck ups if I fall asleep on the job again. Snort some warp dust. Stop the custodians from oiling themselves up and actually do something fucking useful. How did Jellyman get them to do something? Give the Ultramarines a new role, as dog sitters for the Space Wolves. Correction the Space Corgis. Give the Dreadknight pilots a badass helmet or something so snipers don't destroy them. Fuck, just make them tall centurions at this point. Would be more effective than the stilts they are now. Go into the rock and either bitch slap Luther or the lion depending on who the watchers in the dark tattle on. Upgrade all Imperial Titans so they can fly. Find out what Watchers in the Dark actually look like under their robes. Find out what Angel's sanguine faces look like under their helmets. Bitch slap them, in the face if it is actually possible. Every single one of them. Resurrect Relic, and ensure that they make the rest of the Space Marine series. Titus deserves to be a Mithafa King Primarch. Make it Imperial law that at least once a year every Guardsman in the universe is allowed one free beer for the shit they do. Hopefully that should prevent their temptation to go heretic on my ass. Also, make a chain sword. Sword chain to literally whip the Imperium back into shape. Hold the Primarch of the Year award ceremony again. Hopefully Horus can stay away this time. Prevent the victory of chaos in the end times so that Games Workshop has to advance the story instead of pulling a shit reboot that changes nothing. Expect making ground marines and changing race names for no reason. Fuck you Manford. Declare non-furry aliens that can interbreed with humans and have fertile offspring close enough to being humans blum. So love can bloom is a thing then. Well then my webway for elder hookers isn't a lost cause then. Get better cooperation the Imperial Navy and Imperial Guard. 
I lose far too many brave guardsmen because the navy's incompetence leaves them without air support. Combined arms people. This is why we have manuals. Bring back the Squatsblum kill all the Xenos. And bring the Demiurg too. Demote Commander Kubrikchenkov because that idiot isn't fit to lead a parade, and put him in some random platoon that's never heard of him where he might actually kill more enemies than guardsmen. Grab those Elder and TAU plasma weapons. I am not letting highly explosive weapons to stay in use. Seriously. It is like playing Russian roulette with an exterminator not needed anymore as the Mechanicus had finally repaired it so that said Russian roulette will only happen if the user overcharges the gun. Also, get the laser rifles. Number. Moa. Fashlegats. Pat the black dragons on the back for putting up with all the shit that's thrown at them. Buy out Google and enforce fair use on YouTube with an iron fist. Berate the Adeptus Custodus for not preventing Goj Van Dyer's rise to power. Lazy fucks being lazy led to the worst thing for mankind since the Horus heresy. Although considering they would much rather oil themselves, I'm guessing Van Dyer just bribed them with super lubricant. Steal a world engine and start destroying demon worlds with it. Have a backup plan for destroying demon worlds if the world engine can't do that. Finally defeat Lemon Russ in an eating contest and a drinking contest. Find the black library and empty its contents. Then wreck it. Bring Ariman to it and then trick him into thinking that the black library was just an elaborate hoax to troll him. Punish the grey knights for turning on the space wolves and not chopping the heads off those dumbass inquisitors who decided the appropriate response to the space wolves wanting to spare the survivors of the Armageddon war was to try and kill them. Matcha. Should. Be. Fucked. Stop this whole treating beastmen like mutants thing. I did make them citizens for a reason. I mean, they look better than all the gaunt, necron looking women in the Imperium. I need a release too. You know what? Furries are citizens too, so no more of this furfaggatory bullshit. I'd like you to show me something that could track a fucking mouse in a blizzard. Other than a space wolf. A felinid. We made them citizens so the others won't have bullshit arguments like this to be welcomed in. Bottle said tear, and give it to Jerlyman. Then he might actually man up. Mix speed, weed, heroin, cocaine, mushrooms, LSD, tobacco, pinoclean, petrol, diesel, battery acid, acid, salvia, some herbs and spices, some lettuce and tomato, some salt and vinegar, noodles, pretzels, pork scratchings, some donut kebab, vodka sauce, tabasco sauce, bam and the dirt is gone, red bull, coca cola, ajax spray and wipe, liquid hydrogen, protein shakes, some chicken and cheese, hash browns, jalapeno peppers, curry and wrap it all in a tortilla, eat it, make the hive mind eat it, scholar progenium hari maname, starring lucius the eternal, visit that planet where i keep all of my pets, they built a city, rematch the void dragon at that fight, have the mechanicus duff all the others up, get the mechanicus to make me an amp and a massive fucking pair of speakers, then attach them to a banner blade, then plug in my holy guitar and shred so hard I make the Ordinatus Mars look like a disappointing fart. Bring back Warhammer Fantasy. Bring Horus back to life and kill him again. Find Mortarion and give him a bath. Find where those 100 banner blades went. Have Admech convert an Imperator Titan into my new power armor. Release an edict as to which order the gifts go in the song The 12 Days of the Feast of My Ascension. Get Games Workshops to put free digital copies of all out-of-date codexes and army books on their website so fans of old books can still read them. Drain Corn's Blood Lake, then eat his corn flakes while watching sitting in his throne and watching something nobler bright. Give Nurgle's Garden a good spring cleaning, then perma porkisha. Delete Slanesh's porn collection, then replace her crack with sugar. Also, create her extra strength anti viagra and mix it in with the sugar. And whatever is the opposite of laxatives and mix that in with the sugar too. Ghostbust seench his tower, then steal his change. If I have time, kill corn with kindness, kill Slanesh with boredom, kill Nurgle with Mr. Clean, and kill Seench with Warhammer 40k's plot progression. Housebreak the space corgis. Make Carnifex choke on a smurf see what color it turns. Make a Warhammer fighting game. Punch Lorger in the face. Make him fuck the Lexio Divinititus with sandpaper pages. Punch the fucker who balamed me when I made numbers 441 and 443 balam. Balam a commissar cause it'll be funny. Steal one of those Necron pylons and put them on terror so that I no longer have to keep trying to not let it become a new eye of terror. Make scub usage mandatory for all guardsmen blum. Catch all the Setan shards and become the very best, the best that ever was. Give the orcs their home world back. 
Those damn toaster fuckers on Mars had no right to teleport it away and it turn it into Armageddon. Walk into Kamorag, out troll and out dick ass Drobiel Vect, then bitch slap him to death in front of everyone in Kamorag. Then fuck Lilith Hesperax to death before I leave. Point out to Admech that their statement that all technology already exists logically renders innovation impossible, as any attempt would only reproduce something that already exits. Secondly, some STC technology would be otherwise lost permanently. How's that for divine inspiration from the Omniscia? Keep sending Corsero Khan to fight the space communists. Make sure he and Shadowson get it on Balam Heresy. Profit. Kill all the Inquisitors who think it's a good idea to kill all Astropaths and Navigators who we need to stop the Imperium falling apart, and Space Marines because they are fucking awesome. Kill all the Inquisitors who thought that me dying and reincarnating into someone else was a good idea. Build a gun with enough DACA. Show it to the Orcs. Let them fire at me till they run out of ammo. Laugh. Show the Orcs a gun with more than enough DACA, and blast the shit out of them. Kill Lucius the Eternal for good, as he can't possess me. Then resurrect everyone who got possessed, kill any Xenos and Chaos worshippers who killed him, and bro fist anyone from the Imperium who killed him for being able to kill him. Dance, just do a little dance, I was stuck in a chair for 10,000 years, it would feel good to move. Give the Lamenters a hug, they need it. Find out what the Blood Art chapter is from the Banana Stodes, and play the holo game Dawn of War, I hear it's worth playing. Play Stellaris as xenophobic militant humans to see what the Great Crusade could have been. Make a Primarch out of the commander of XCOM because he is far more competent than anyone in the Imperium. Attend Angelo's and Match's wedding, and then promptly allow Elred to fuck shit up. Give my caretaker kiss and pay since he doesn't get any. Then send him to get tea, and Carnifex crumpets. Keep an eye on Robo Jellyman's waifu. Fuck, how many Primarchs, Space Marines, and Chapter Masters have girlfriends now? Even if there isn't an actual connection, keep an eye on the shippers. But don't read the fanfics. Cut off Faptor and Schledge Torhan. Eat a meat bread. Rub some scrub on me bones. Yah. Work out that crick in my lower back. Go to Emperor Burger and get an MP meal. Go back in time to finish the Webway project and get elder prostitutes for myself and my sons. That should stop them from bitching constantly. Punch all the marines malevolent for being such dicks. Thank the lamenters for getting shit done. Bitch slap Gilliman for being a douchebag smurf. Bitch slap the rest of the ultra twits. Have my daily time with adorable centurion. Yell at the Inquisition and Grey Knights for thinking the Dark Angels are heretics. Officially rename the Primaris Primarisus. Drink 10 pots of espresso. Seriously, sitting stationary for about 11 millennia makes you need energy. Convince Inner to bring Sanguinius back to life. Then make him Lord Commander of the Imperium. Make the battle cry of all Gordsmen under 20 to be for the Imperium. Oh fuck I dropped my bwongat. Put a warp drive into a rhino and fly into the Eye of Terror. Screaming metal boxers because why the fuck not. Make Sly Marbo the ruler of the Imperium because I need to catch up on shit that I missed while sitting on a motherfucking mechanical toilet for the, the 10,000 fucking years. Tell Mortaring to have a bath. Tell Abaddon to grow a pair of arms. Decide if traps are gay or not. Go digging through the ruins of old earth and find some tank designs from late M2 slash early M3. Figure out if Sly Marbo can talk, or make any vocalizations other than aaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaaa
you know, uh, Total Recall. Remember the old Total Recall movie at the end when the eyes explode and shit? That's what the Kasuti would look like after telling uh, what's uh, what what the current state of the 41st millennium is. Although, like, as always, let us know what you thought. Is there any bits that you would have added? Like, you know, what would you, what do you think the Emperor would get up to the second he woke up, you know, and started like, right, like, this needs done, like, this needs done, and that needs done. What do, what do you think? You know, I thought it covered quite a lot of bits, like, you know, there was a lot of points all over the place, like, you know, and I thought some of the stuff was actually genuinely really sensible. But hey, let us know what you thought. But as always, um, like and subscribe to stay up to speed with any and all further videos. I uh, hope you enjoy it, and I'll see you in the next one. If you haven't already, check out my Redbubble portfolio. You might just find something you like. This, this is, is not okay. This needs to stop now. This is cancer. This is... This is so much cancer that I can feel the tumors growing on my back. And it's way down heavy on me, and it's not okay. Can you help a nigga out and just stop this? Please?